Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy Fonte over here on another video, and in this one, guys, I'm going to be comparing an iPhone 6 and iOS 11.4 Beta 6 to 10.3.3. Guys, Apple released uh, Beta 6 yesterday, it was unexpected. It's just a 55 megabyte update, so it's very small. So, uh, since I didn't compare the Beta 5 on the iPhone 6 yet, I will do Beta 6, I will cover that instead. So, as always, guys, stay tuned. All right, guys, so I'm gonna put up both devices here. Uh, this is the one on iOS. 11.4 beta 6 and that's the one on 10.3.3 so that's it it was uh, very unexpected uh, 55 megabyte update uh, on this phone so guys it's pretty small and since i didn't cover beta 5 i'm covering this let's hope that though with this one any any issues will be like covered with a Boot up, but guys, they did really remove a bug that uh, when you receive you used to receive a message, the phone would crash or lag. Wow, guys, beta six iOS eleven point four beta six was actually faster than ten point three point three. That's something, guys. First time ever happening here, guys. I can't believe it. Good stuff. So now just jumping to the phones. Okay, some animation lag there, guys. Ten point three point three was smoother. All right, guys. So both phones here have nothing in the background. So let's just start. So first up, calendar. Identical, going for camera, fast from 10.3.3, going for maps, and yeah, fast from 10.3.3, guys, going for clock, same, I mean, 11, 10 is faster, weather, seemed faster than iOS 11, guys, I think it was faster indeed, stocks, 10.3, phone dialer, faster than 11, going for Safari, alert Apple.com, Looking on this here. So I click on buy then. And both phones take some time. So it's faster than iOS 10, guys. Leaving. Leaving was faster than iOS 11. I have to say that. Going for settings. Slightly faster than iOS 10. Now guys, for some lag on both devices, they're swiping to the left. So going for FaceTime, faster on 10 as well, guys. Going for finally some third party apps, hoping for some improvements here. So Mario Run. I mean, guys, this is the fourth iOS on this phone. So it, got, it was released with eight and got nine, 10 and now 11. Yeah, for so both phones are okay. iOS 10 is faster here. Going out, both were smooth leaving. Next up, guys, Temperan 2. And if you're wondering, that sound in the background is just rain, guys, so just don't mind it. Loading bar finished. Okay, iOS 10 won't, guys. Different, difference though is not that big, it's minimal. So, one, no, 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 not even a, sec a second, maybe let's say. Going out, going for into the benchmark. And iOS 10 definitely won here. Geekbench 4. Okay, so third party apps till now, it seems like iOS 10 is still faster, still better, guys, and loading everything. Sadly, Google Earth would be. Okay, same, guys, iOS 10 is still faster. Everything till now is faster than iOS 10, sadly. Subway Surfers. Some hesitation there on iOS 11.4 beta 6. Okay, loading bar appeared here. Definitely some difference there, guys. Going for YouTube. Both taking some time. Definitely iOS 10, guys. So now going for Instagram. I mean, I hope something would actually be faster here, but nope, nope, guys. It's still iOS 10 definitely wins. Going for Facebook. Okay, yeah, Facebook was faster than iOS 10 as well, guys. I mean, everything's almost faster. All third party apps are faster than iOS 10. So guys, for some uh, multitasking, let's see if uh, iOS 11.4 beta 6 improve anything here, guys. 
So first up, calendar. Nope. Had to refresh. Camera. Okay, that had to refresh on both maps. Okay, I refresh on both. Clock. Weather. Stocks. Phone. Safari. Settings. FaceTime. I think both, both have to refresh. I mean, iOS 10, 11 definitely, but thinking I, iOS 10 too, guys, going for Super Mario. Okay. Temple Run 2 here. Into the benchmark. Geekbench 4. Google Earth. Subway Surfers. YouTube. I think it had to refresh, guys. So the picture just froze there and took some time just like refreshing but pretending it's still there. Instagram. Yep, I think that was a refresh. Facebook. Okay, so that was Captain IS 10 guys. Now guys for a Geekbench 4 test. So here we have the scores. Um, definitely a better score here on uh, iOS 10. iOS 11 I got a lower single core and a multi-core score, so be definitely better here. Let's just check history. I'm just showing you a previous core. And yep, 11.4 beta 4 guys, that was beta 4, uh, had a better score than, than this current beta 6. Now for final test here, onto the benchmark. All right, guys, here we have the scores. A slight improvement over the previous one. I don't know, this one was at 78,000, and this one at 80,000. So definitely something welcomed here. Just going to show you the scores. Everything in detail. CPU is about the same. CPU was higher on iOS 11.4, beta 6. GPU is always higher on iOS 10 for some reason. UX as well. RAM, definitely. Let's just check the UX here, as you see. Uh, yeah, so user experience score. It's actually better on iOS 11. That's the first time me seeing such a thing here. Uh, though yeah, other stuff are definitely, no, not everything. Data security score is better here. Uh, and data processing score is definitely here, guys. Everything else is all the same. And let's just check the RAM. So as you can see, RAM is about the same. ROM though was better on iOS uh, 10. All right, guys, so that was the comparison. I want to say that this phone on iOS 10.3.3 dropped from 69% to 56, so 13% only. This one dropped from 64 to 42. So iOS 11 lost more battery, and 22%, guys, this lost 13. Um, yeah, performance is definitely better on iOS 10, 10, guys, of course. RAM, same. Everything, guys, is better on iOS 10. Hope you guys like the video. Subscribe for more content. Peace out.